The teachers will not only be expected to welcome students back into the classroom, but they'll also be giving virtual instruction to students who are home. Some teachers and parents are now wondering if this hybrid plan is better or worse. More than 200 pages long, CCSD's hybrid instructional guide describes what parents and teachers should expect as students are integrated back into classrooms for in-person learning. When it comes to in-class instruction, teachers will teach face-to-face -face and virtually at the same time. The plan states teachers are responsible for providing synchronous and asynchronous sessions. Synchronous is learning that happens in real time for students, like video conferencing lessons on Google Meet. Asynchronous is recorded video and other digital media students can work on on their own time. The plan said webcams, USB extenders, headsets with mics and tripods were purchased and distributed to schools to support the hybrid instructional model. Most schools received up to 30 kits. Canvas will continue to be the online software for students and staff. On our Fox 5 Facebook page, parents and others complained this hybrid model doesn't feel anything like being back to school. Many feel their kids will still be learning virtually, only they'll be inside a classroom. One post said, might as well stay at home. Ridiculous. Another wrote, what is the point of being in person if you are still working on a computer? One teacher emailed me and said that the district is not considering the difficulties that teachers will have to face uh, teaching both hybrid and virtual on a daily basis. Uh, I spoke with a parent tonight that said she pulled her kindergartner from returning to this hybrid uh, model after a teacher gave her a heads up that this was happening. Reporting live from Las Vegas, Lauren Martinez, Fox 5 News.